going into it, I just kind of thought I got to go out there and show that I am in national shape. Um, I'd already qualified in, in the events I wanted to, but I just had to make sure that um, I myself know that I am ready to go ahead and defend my, my titles and uh, let the rest of the world know that I'm still ready to defend my titles as well. I have run 66 before, 663 before, um, but what my main focus on was just to go out there and execute the way um, I haven't been in the previous races. I've been running six, I opened up with 66, but I've been running 67 consistently all year. So uh, my main focus is going out there and executing the race, uh, try to figure out my race pattern. Um, and I think I did that and I you know, ran 66 again and I was thrilled with that. Then the 200 came around and I felt in such good shape. I actually said before I, I ran the race, I was like, I feel like I can run 20.7. Um, and went out there. Luckily, I had a guy on my outside who could go 20.8. So just chasing him and then getting to the last little part of the race where I had my strength to kick in was amazing. And I was excited as, as all when I, when I crossed the line and saw the time. The 4x4, it was, it was a good race. Everyone stepped up really just to make sure that we qualified for nationals. Before the race ran, we looked at the list and we looked at where we were. I think we were 13th just outside of qualifications. And so once we realized that, everyone realized that they really had to put, put in everything uh, for us to run. Luckily, we had uh, Western Kentucky out there as well, who we knew was a good team um, to, to push us throughout the whole way. And then for my last leg, I just had to make sure I went after it all with all I could. It feels great. It feels really good um, to know that, to see like my work being noticed. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, at the same time, it's like, National of the Week is cool, but I want at like National Athlete of the Year, you know, like Athlete of the Week is cool, it's fun, but I want to be National Athlete of the Year again. Yeah, right now it's just, uh, we're just in that phase where we're maintaining uh, what we have. Like we've shown that, you know, the, this Boston meet, we had so many people qualify for Nationals that even going forward, it's like, we're just trying to hold on to what we have right now, just build a little bit on that, get some, some more speed going. Um, make, sure our, make sure our muscles are right. So everyone's just in the mentality of nationals now. We're really uh, gearing down everything that we've worked on throughout the whole year, putting it all together. This season, we targeted Boston as, as one of our, our big meets, um, where we knew it was gonna be our last chance to qualify. We got a chance to see what you know, other teams around the country were doing and, and kind of hone in and, and set ourselves up to be able to, to earn a spot you know, at the NCAA championships. Going into nationals, you always want the athlete to feel prepared. Um, the toughest thing is when they go in with, with any kind of doubt and you know it's something that they're doing for the first time uh, it's tough for them to compete well at, at nationals so you know we want wanted to to be where they're going into nationals and we're not doing anything new you know it's it's the same old same old the same thing we've been working on all year it's just that now we're doing it at a higher level um, and they're more prepared and they feel more comfortable doing it because they've been doing it throughout the season. So we try not to change anything up for them going into nationals. Um, you know, it's another meet for us and, you know, we just ask them to go and just give everything they got.